before the video starts, make sure to check out my Patreon where you can get exclusive benefits from early access to sponsorships. If you would like to join, click the link in the description below and select one of these levels and become a John John Army member. And now let's get on to the video. What up? It's John John, and welcome to Paranormal Entities. I found this game on itch.io. Link to this game will be in the description below for y'all to check it out for yourselves. It says you are Cliff, a college student who is, who is a brand new freelance cameraman for the show Paranormal Entities, the number two rated ghost investigation show on the Hunting and Outdoors Cable Network. You have you have been hired to inspect the St. Augustine Asylum for the mentally ill. You will go into this facility, follow the producer's instructions through a radio earpiece, keep your camera on, and try to make contact with the spirits inside. If nothing happens, you will get $500 for your time. If you manage to get some amazing footage of real paranormal activity on your camera, you will get an additional $2,500 bonus. Are you ready to be part of the, of the paranormal entity's history? Let's play. All right, Clint, uh, Cliff, 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 welcome to the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. My producer Tom said good things about you. In your backpack is a flashlight, a voice recorder, an EMF, and a couple of little fun occult things. We'll let you know when to take those out. Ready to pay off some of those college debts and beer tabs? Well, of course you are. And when you're ready, enter in through those front doors. Unlocked. Ah, it can get a little sticky sometimes. So here's the story behind the St. Augustine's Asylum for the Mentally Ill. It was founded in the 1880s, closed in the 1960s, and a lot of nasty stuff happened here. I mean, this place is only supposed to house around 500 patients, but at its peak, it was around 3,300 patients in here. I mean, the place was, you know, less of a hospital and more of a place where you drop your problems off and hope they disappeared. These doors. Wow. This is where the hundred hallways patients would convene, and we heard that the patients pre-1920 actually received decent care. Then the war hit, the depression hit, and then the budgets all fell apart. The room you stand in once healed 20 patients in need of attention, and by the end, 150 patients would pass through this room, naked, starving, attacking each other at random, slaying themselves with metal wires from their beds. Be careful where you step. Alright, this is a good place to start. I want you to take out your voice recorder, and I'll hopefully be able to awaken this place. Okay, spirits of St. Augustine, please reveal your presence to us. Show us that you are in this room. Feel free to interact with anything, or speak to us. Use your words, use your voice, and let us know that you're here. Okay, play that back. Let's try that again. Okay, so the Alright, alright, let's try this. Ghosts of St. Augustine, please let us know that you are still in this hospital. I give you permission to reveal yourself. I give you permission to come to life. Just give us a sign that you are here. Tell us where you are. Speak to 
to us now into this microphone. Alright, check that. Now into this microphone. Alright, let's try one more spot. <sighs> Ghosts of St. Augustine, you're all a bunch of ghoulish pricks. Show up or piss off! What the fuck? This is some satanic Come shit. Come forward and live again. This person is no longer what? shielded from the realm what of death. What the fuck? You may be seen, interact, and manipulate him in any way as you see fit. What in the hell? Record that shit. What am I supposed to do? Touch it? Goddamn hell. Get the hell out of there. Just just go to the front door and get out. <laughs> you all got me fucked up. <laughs> Can't even fucking run. All right, get out of this hallway and then take a take your second right. Oh, okay, there's a there's a staircase. Take the staircase up to the second floor, and you should be next to a fire escape. You should be able to get out that way. So so go up the staircase. Take it to the sixth floor. Crap. Oh, okay, 
we need to... Let's go get something to pry this door open. Go back downstairs. I, I bet you there was something downstairs we could probably use. Oh. Didn't let me know that before. Oh, I'm locked. Hold on, hold on. That staircase wasn't there before. This place doesn't even have a basement. What the... What, what is going on? Alright, I just... I don't think you got any other choice. I think you gotta make your way downstairs. God damn hell, how are you fucking... I'm gonna start... Thing. We have to follow the candles? Fucking... Ridiculous. Following the candles. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! What the hell? Oh, so now I'm stuck in this fucking hallway now. Yep. And these doors are f unlocked. Yep, I'm stuck in this hallway. Giving me any further instructions just to get the fuck out of this room. I got nowhere else to go. Okay. Good enough. 
until I figure this shit out, I will play again. Um, thank you guys very much for watching. If you want to see a part two, let's get it to 20 likes. Let's get it to 20 likes, and I'll drop that next video of paranormal entities. So, thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you guys in a brand new video.